We are Southampton University Distributed Electric Propulsion and our aim was to design, manufacture and test a UAV which makes use of this concept. Distributed propulsion is the spread of propulsor modules across the span of the wing, covering a large area of the wing in the prop wash resulting in an increased local velocity and therefore lift production for a given airspeed. To take advantage of the blown wing effect, flap design and prop placement is optimised for a trade-off between low speed performance and cruising efficiency. A Fowler flap design is chosen to increase wing area and camber, extending along tracks. During flight testing, the UAV successfully achieved short takeoff and landing, validating CFD and simulation data. Full flap deployment aided in low speed cruise which when coupled with the blown wing increased our stall angle. When operating in a headwind and a high pitch angle, the UAV was observed to almost hover. During landing, the lower throttle and the motors reduced the blown wing effect and potentially the lift too much. To maintain lift production, the throttle was kept constant and an air brake was proposed for powered altitude control. The air brake is designed to induce an increased drag, resulting in a glide slope of six degrees. The airframe consists of a plywood core housing various electronics. The air brake and tail are connected through a single tail boom with multiple bulkheads used to resist bending and torsional loads. A 4 degree dihedral angle is added to improve the lateral stability of the UAV. The performance of the blown flaps and the air brake were investigated in the RJ Mitchell wind tunnel. The results of this testing validated our design leading us to full iron bird tests. Foam wing sections are bonded to carbon fibre spars and plywood ribs, wrapped in fibreglass, reducing both wing bending and twist. The aircraft is designed for a static margin of 0.15, with the centre of gravity placed at approximately quarter cord. Successful static testing led to two days of flight testing. Our design completed four accomplished flights, showcasing a wide flight envelope with a range of possible cruise speeds. The UAV demonstrated a cruise endurance of 15 minutes, Pilot feedback on stability was positive while still incorporating manoeuvrability.